So thank you very much for coming and uh, please do enjoy the rest of the afternoon in the symposium. May I now invite Professor Joan to present the opening keynotes on the role of infection control in emerging infections. So they've got a fever, pneumonia, that's similar at the 33 or 7 days. That's indicated as strong contagious uh, characteristics. So I remember at that time, so the WHO uh, invited me to, to have a discussion. <laughs> So, for example, uh, studies that further determine the importance of proximity on human-to-human -human transmission, studies that may improve our current understanding about the heterogeneity of virus shedding between individuals and within the same persons over time. We have some idea about the transmission route, and of course the nose and the mouth, that's the first one that comes to play and, and gives you an idea, but the eyes may also play a role, so we have to look into that. Also air or contact, surface contact. Influenza virus is not a particularly contagious infection. We know that in the community, uh, on average, one person who's infected will infect another one or two people. He wouldn't infect, on average, another 10, 20 or 50 people. It's not a highly contagious infection, but it is contagious. The next presenter is Dr. Samira Mubarika, Assistant Professor of Laboratory Medicine and Pathobiology of the University of Toronto. Potential solutions and next steps. We need to continue having a cross-disciplinary approach, and I think meetings like this are really essential. So, in summary, viral RNA or viable avian influenza viruses of H5, H7, and H9 subtypes were readily detectable in the air and supporting the visibility of airborne transmission at the human poultry interface. So, in summary, we have developed a probabilistic model based on um, very simple homogeneous, non homogeneous person process to explicitly describe how epidemic arrival times depend on local epidemic growth rate and the networked uh, parameters uh, and the model works very well. Uh, I think it's a great pleasure to, to thank all the speakers for a really excellent symposium. Uh, tokens of appreciation to all the speakers. So thank you again. <laughs>